First, we need to install GrabDoc add-on. It's a free add-on. You will find the link in the description. I'm going to use these panels to create the displacement map. You can download for free from uh, Gumbro. The size of this is 2 meters by 2 meters. Now press N. Go to GrabDoc add-on and click Setup Scene. I'm going to preview normal map. As you can see, the camera is perfectly aligned to the model. But we need to add a bevel modifier to work correctly. Now we can go back to preview map. To create the displacement map, click on height. By default, the scale is 2 meters by 2 meters. Select where to save. Choose the name, the resolution. Also choose format and compression. Then click export. We can create curvature, occlusion, and ID maps, but to create the ID map we need separated objects. So I'm going to apply bevel modifier, then select all faces, hit P and click by loose parts. And now it works correctly. To test the displacement map I'm going to use Optane for Blender. You can download it for free. But if you want to render with cycles, I have a tutorial where I explain how to use weight adaptive subdivision and micro polygon displacement. Or you may use a displacement fire if you want to render with Eevee. I'm going to create the material. Add an image texture. Also a texture displacement. and plug into displacement. Then select the displacement map we have created and increase the height. To tile the texture, create a 3D transform knob and connect to texture. Okay, that's all. I hope you have enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching.